Lara Dickenman, we are in uh, Mönchengladbach today. Uh, difficult game for Wolfsburg? Uh, yeah, it's been a difficult week for us because uh, yeah, not so many good results. But um, the most important is that we won 2-1 to one now that we scored that second goal. It doesn't matter how ugly it was or how hard it was. Um, we made it through the last game of the week and these three points are really important. Yeah. Uh, this season Wolfsburg has it very difficult to score goals. Uh, any reason why? Oh, that's a good question. Um, if only we knew, but um, I think this has been the hardest week so far. And before that, um, we scored the goals that we we had to. So mm -hmm. it's not as big a, a problem. Um, we just need to keep working. And um, now it's Champions League time. That's always uh, very exciting for us and a dif different. Um, uh, competition so yeah I don't know now we need to think about recovering first and then think about scoring goals but um, I'm not worried we have a lot of players that can score goals on all the positions so Poppy was a little bit unlucky for example today but she can score uh, at any time and um, we'll just keep going we'll work at practice and it's gonna be fine yes yeah. I mentioned Gladbach scored the 1-1 was there a nervous nervousness in the team um, I mean, it's never a good feeling when the, the opponent scores mm -hmm. with almost their first um, shot in the game and we dominated the whole game, so it's hard, but um, we try to stay positive. We, our leaders on the field, um, Bobet Peter, Nila Fischer, and we, everyone tried to stay positive and we kept fighting until the end and uh, luckily we scored the second one, but I think we deserve it and um, we fought hard for it, so it's not a, a stolen win. Okay. Then uh, in the week that comes, you said it, uh, you go to Sweden, Eskastina United, you know something about them? Uh, not so much so far, because we have been very busy with the championship, but um, mm. we will analyze them, of course, and uh, I'm sure our coaches know a lot about them already. Mm. I know they're a good team, I know they've been doing well in the Swedish league, which is a very competitive league as well. So, um, yeah, it's going to be a very hard two games, and uh, but we're looking forward to them. Mm -hmm. And then in the coming week also, on Tuesday, something very important, the draw for the Euro 2017 Switzerland is also there. Are there opponents you want to avoid or you want to prefer to play? Mm, I mean, there's only good teams, so <laughs> I don't want to avoid anyone. Um, I would love to play against France just because I played yeah. there for a long time and I know a lot of the girls and they're a very good team. They're a very exciting team to play against, they're always trying to play ball and um, we're trying to do that too with Switzerland, um, maybe on a little lower level than them, of course, but um, that should be an exciting game and Germany would be fun to play as well. Yeah. Um, yeah, other than that, I don't really care. I'm glad to be there for the first time and I'm looking forward to Tuesday and the draft. Uh, and there are many nationalities in your team of Wolfsburg. Uh, will you all look together to the draw on the same time, Tuesday? That's a good question. Um, I'm not sure. Maybe we're going to plan something. We haven't talked about it yet, but maybe, yeah. Okay. Thank you and good luck. Thank you. Thank you.